Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on Akuma MC Skyblock and in this video we're going to be going over and making a pretty good mob farm and we're just going to be grinding out. So let's get straight into it and I want to start off with this epic airdrop and we got this from some quests so let's see what we get from it. We get some ranks, some tags, we get some keys and we get a weekly cluster that seems pretty good. It is the bottom reward and we also get some money packages and stuff so let's just go straight ahead and open it and let's hope for something good and okay we place it down. Okay, it falls from the sky. Okay, a little cool animation and let's see so we got we got a whole bunch of money we got 31 mil which is pretty insane we did complete a quest and we got 10 spider spawners we got a random tag we got a chunk hopper which is kind of it's kind of not that good but let's go back to my island i didn't expand the farm or anything but we are definitely are going to look into that but okay 10 spider spawners we would definitely take that will actually be pretty helpful and okay so i want to go ahead and check out the challenges i think slash quest let's see what we got from that so from the opening the airdrop we got 20k and a common chunk hopper and the next one is to place a chunk hopper so that is really easy so let's just place one down boom and from that we did get three pig spawners okay that's pretty good and then the next reward or next quest is to place the three pig spawners so okay let's see where they are at and okay that's pretty easy too and okay we got, we got a grinding book for that okay we're definitely going to take that and open that at the enchanter soon and the next challenge is to kill 50 pigs okay so i'm going to let them stack up and but while i do that i want to work to the enchanter actually and open up this book see what, if we get any good enchants from it so boom let's see hopefully we get, get something good and then we'll grind out some mobs in order to get the xp so we have ether ethereal which gives us haste which could be pretty useful to our pickaxe we got bolt which has a chance to lightning strike mobs and we got sharpness which boosts damage so i currently think the best thing here is probably ethereal i really don't know but let's just go ahead and do that we can definitely get some more enchants later if this doesn't work but okay so we got that let's see what let's see how many levels we do need for that so let's put our pickaxe in and okay i don't even think we can put it on our pickaxe let's see what it's Okay, it goes on our sword, and we need 25 levels. Okay, we actually get that, so boom. Internet applied successfully. Okay, we're definitely going to take that. Let's go back to my island. And, okay, so currently, right now, I do have this... Okay, let me just do slash fly. I do have this iron golem set up into this chunk hopper. I mean, I've only had it for a little bit, but on the iron golems, I do have a fire scroll, which basically what this does, it sets the mobs on fire. Because some mobs can only be killed by fire, I'm pretty sure pigs can just, like... I'm pretty sure you can just hit them. Yeah, you can just hit them, but for iron golems, you cannot actually hit them to kill them. You have to have a specific grinder that puts them on fire in order to kill them so yeah that is why the scrolls are pretty good and they only cost 5k gems per so yeah they should be pretty easy to get and if we get a few then we can definitely set up a pretty big farm that's gonna be very very helpful and useful i'm pretty sure we get gems from just like farming so i'm pretty sure we get it from farming mining and grinding and you can also get it from from crate keys and stuff and i do it for just remember we do have a ton of crate keys to open so let's open up to go let's go to slash crates we have 32 cloud keys and it looks like it's about it so let's open up all of those and we get a warlord rank so we're definitely gonna take that and okay so we got some cell wands okay okay we got 250 use which is pretty good some more chunk hoppers we got some chicken spawners cow spawners a value ticket okay let's uh go ahead and claim that so 2.66k value not bad and two more dungeon keys i honestly don't know when we're, when we're gonna take a look at these dungeons i'm pretty sure they like i, I mean i assume they're probably gonna be pretty good so i kind of want to do it it says click just warp dungeons okay i just want to do some warp dungeons and see if it like has any rewards so boom dungeon you must be holding a dungeon key okay we might actually go ahead and do that i don't really know but let's go back to the island i want to go ahead and set up this grinder at least set up a kind of grinder so let me go do that real quick and i mean grinding out for those gems will be kind of hard because we do need a ton of them so maybe we get them off somebody or something i don't really know but yeah those fire scrolls are going to be very useful to us i mean i could temporarily set up where they fall into fire which i might actually do so yeah be right back once i do have a pretty decent farm set up okay so i am done building the mob farm and this is basically it it's just a simple fire thing they they dine the they drop they die in the lava and okay i'm gonna have to fix this but sometimes they might spawn here but then i have this chest system up here so the chunk hopper is here and i'll basically go into these chests down here but i didn't realize there's actually a hopper limit so uh we're kind of at like a weird place right now but the basically the drops are gonna go in here and then i guess i will like a cell wand or something and yeah but we're definitely going to have to upgrade the hopper limit and i think the only or not only way but i know one way to do it is by doing the ice perks and we need to defeat 10k mobs which is kind of insane it's kind of a lot but we did get three grinding books because we did also kill 150 pigs so let's go to the enchanter slash warp enchanter and we're gonna see if we can get any good enchants from this and hopefully we do because we do need some good enchants and okay we can only do one at a time let's see hopefully for something good so we got looting more loot uh boost undead damage and gives haste okay we're gonna go with looting because looting is always gonna be good it's gonna just give us more drops and stuff and then let's go for the next enchant let's see hopefully we get something really really good so we got smite book hunter 
sharpness okay we're gonna do sharpness because right now we don't even one tap our mobs and yeah sharpness is gonna help us like the hun because if one tapping will just help us get so much more xp and just kill mobs way faster multi-kill okay honestly multi-kill seems like the best right now i'm gonna be honest killing more mobs at once would be pretty insane to us and let's see how much this costs to apply 96 for 96 percent 42 levels okay we get that pretty easily for sharpness it will cost 25 levels okay we can actually do that now and it did apply so we're definitely going to take that what about looting looting 42 okay so we're gonna need like 84 levels in total for those two so yeah we might go ahead and grind those in a little bit but let's go back to the island i do want to go ahead and sell a chest with a sub one real quick even though they're not full so let's just go ahead and pick a random one left click to inspect and okay left click to inspect or i don't even know what this means okay so the chest okay so you can actually left click the chest and it actually tells you how much they are worth so let's see which chest has the most items and okay i guess it's this one and that's worth 4k right there that one's worth 4.9k and this one's worth 1k so as you can see like the buff form's only been going for a bit and it is making a decent bit of money real quick and as we do get more spawners and stuff it's just gonna be very very good to us and get us a ton of money so let's go ahead and sell those real quick and okay let me just go like that and there should be someone here yeah right here so okay that's a little bit of money we made we we'll definitely take it and as we as i said if we do get more spawners it is definitely going to help us and i am leaving some up here i'm gonna put pigs and blazes up here because those ones actually i probably could put pigs down actually yeah let me put pigs down here so let me break all these spawners and that actually might have been how the pig got down there i don't think i have a pig down here so let me just go plop them down right somewhere here and boom that should be pretty good now and we are going to get the pig drops so yeah we are honestly pretty good that is a pretty good mob farm that we have set up and i actually want to go ahead and mine all this wheat because we do have a lot and it is going to help us towards our farming progress and farming skills and just a whole bunch of stuff like that and i mean i think there is more farming quests i really don't know i thought there was gonna be way more than the start but we still are pretty pretty far in the start i mean we have done quite a bit of quests let's see what the next one says Two thousand grinding action okay i guess that means just like okay wait so i was at 601 let's see if it goes up from just farming and if you take a look okay i didn't so i really don't know what grinding actions means but i probably something to do with farming i really don't know we don't have to check that out but yeah let me sell all this wheat and stuff i just got and see how much i make and so i sell oh and for 7k it's not bad at all for that little bit of a farm that we do have let me just double check to make sure the quest didn't go up and it didn't so I think it's probably from killing mobs or something. I really don't know. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. I have to probably look into that. So, 2,000 grinding actions. Yeah, I, I will have to probably look into that because I don't really know what that means. But, yeah, that's the thing that's going to be it for the quest. And let's see what else we can do. I think I'm going to go ahead and grind for some XP for these books. And I'll be right back once I do. Okay, so we got 43 levels. So, that's enough to enchant one book. I think I'm going to go ahead and enchant the multi-kill for now. And then we might hold off on the looty book because grinding does take a little bit so yeah let's go ahead and apply boom it did apply so we're definitely gonna take that we have a decent sword honestly let's go to the island and see if it's any different okay let me try to find okay 400 picks right here and let's see okay i am seeing the multi-kill working so that is really good and what else we have sharpness so we should be killing them a lot faster now so that is definitely going to help us a ton grinding and we are definitely going to take that and those enchants are going to be very very useful to us and yeah it's gonna be helpful to grinding and i am going to apply this looting book later once i do get some more experience and stuff we also did get five chicken spawners from a quest so let's go ahead and put that into our farm real quick we do have a pretty good farm going we have we have a pretty good variety of spawners so that should be banging us a decent amount of money we're gonna go ahead and afk that but i think i'm going to wrap things up there we made a bit of progress in this video we got a pretty good mob farm set up so make sure to like and subscribe for more videos here on the akuma mc skyblock round and i'll see you in the next one peace out